The Fair Review Mechanism Committee has submitted its report to the Transport Ministry. This comes after several delays. Its findings will be released to the public tomorrow. Our reporter Olivia Siong joins me now with more. Olivia. Well, the committee had been tasked to undertake a review of the fare adjustment formula and the framework for fare adjustments in March last year. It was originally supposed to have submitted its findings sometime early this year, but this was first postponed to May and later to a few months after June. In a blog post today, chairman of the committee Richard Magnus said time had been taken to gather quantitative feedback. Some 4,600 households in Singapore were polled on their thoughts on various possible concession schemes, including which schemes should be prioritised. They were also asked for their views on how the burden of paying for the cost of more concession schemes should be shared. Mr Magnus said the committee had tried to gather as many views as possible, but at the same time also recognised there would be competing needs from public transport operators and various commuter groups, and the difficult task would be in balancing these needs. Mr Magnus added that the committee had tried to suggest how limited resources can be distributed to meet the needs of different users of public transport. Details of the committee's findings will be made known tomorrow and in a statement thanking the committee, Transport Minister Lui Tuck Yu said his ministry will study the report in detail and provide a response next week. Back to you. Olivia Xiang there reporting.